field school, and as well as I'm sure several other people have mentioned, it does let you get hands on. But it's the real thing, so if you're considering this as a major, this is probably the best way to find out if it's right for you. But the students come from all walks of life, uh, and also from many different disciplines. And uh, so we get a, a good mixture, and it's a cross-fertilization. It really creates a synergy while we're excavating to have uh, students from a variety of disciplines working here at the site together. Well, I'm an English major. I actually took um, biological anthropology at UC as well, and went through a series to fulfill my science requirements, natural science. Doc came to um, class one day and pitched the idea of doing a uh, field study and I just thought that was so cool and so I mean I think that when you experience a lot of different areas it can only enhance the larger body of knowledge that you accumulate across the entire span of your college career. So. The, uh, as organic matter decomposes it leaves stains in the soil and that's what we've been documenting and what Megan and Maria have just been doing is taking the dimensions of the features that have been exposed in the shovel scraping and that's what we see here and these are probably internal features inside um, probably some type of dwelling. And I'm now using a shovel instead of a trowel to try and scrape off the plow zone to catch up to where most of the artifacts are going to be, um, at least in situ. So most of the what's on top has just been moved by a plow, damaged, so it doesn't really necessarily mean it's where it was laid down 2,000 years ago. I've cleaned the dirt from the screen, which is super fun. And um, basically, when you dig a section or a level in your unit, you take it to the screen, and you put the dirt through the screen so you can get like really smaller artifacts, like um, shards or smaller rocks or stuff like this. A little um, room tree, I think you called it. Yeah, which I totally thought was just really hard dirt. So, it's been good for that. <laughs> this is an example of an archaic style uh, point. It's uh, biface, it's sharpened on both sides. It's meant to be attached right here in this groove to a long shaft. The shaft normally will be split. This will be inset and then wrapped around really tight. Uh, archaeology is one of those uh, few subjects in which you can, first of all, you can get a, a very well-paying job uh, with just a baccalaureate degree. And right now, there are actually more jobs than there are students to fill them. And that's a very rare circumstance right now.